guys and welcome back. Today I'm going to be showing you guys how to make the easiest bracelet in the world. You're just going to be needing two different types of yarn. So, I'm going to start with the first yarn. I'm going to set these things down. <laughs> and you're just going to put the end of the string to your thumb and finger and stretch it out to where it meets this bun right here. It's sticking out. And you're just going to cut Boink. And we can put this side. Now, for one of your other strings, doesn't matter. Do the same thing. Like this. I'm going to put myself. Fold it and then measure it up and then cut it to where it's extra longer. Like that. See? And then you're done with the scissors. So. On to the next step. Okay, guys. Now you're going to grab your pink string, set it aside, and then your other color that we did the loop on, you're going to even it out, then you're going to cut it. Cut the loop. Boink. Then you're going to tie the ends together in a knot. Make sure it's kind of long so you can tie it onto your wrist later. So yeah, that's pretty long enough. Then grab some tape and, you know, tape it down. Let me get some light in here. Ready? Three, two, one. Boink! Okay. So, you'll have one color on the side, and the two same colors will be on one side and the middle. Something like this. Now you can start on either side, doesn't matter. Basically, you can either make a four, see, you know, or you can just do it like me. I just put the color over it and then loop it under. Now for this, you're going to want to pull it out, like this, and then leave it, and then you do it on the same side. So you can either make a four, or just put the string over the same string and then loop it through. Again, you're going to have it face on the outside, and you're going to pull it up. So, and that should start creating a pattern. You cannot see it right now because... It's still in the very beginning, so, you know, keep doing the same thing. This is quite easy. If you don't know how to do this, then, you know, watch closer. So, put the outer color string over the middle, then bring it through. Have the string on the outside, and lift it. You can have it super loose. I don't remember recommend it super loose but loose or you can do it tight to whether it makes it smaller and then you know looser is whenever you have it more wider and then you know the pattern starts to create and then whenever I start getting closer to done I'll show you what it be looking like it's Becoming. Alright. So now we just keep going until it grows and grows. Okay, now you can see more of the pattern. How, you know, it kind of looks like a zipper. Which to me looks really cool because you can do some really cool designs on it. And you know, you just keep doing your pattern. And then it'll, you know, you. Bare, you really don't need that many much string to do this kind of bracelet because you know you're just doing one loop unlike the other bracelets I'll be showing you on further on throughout the YouTube so yeah and this is like really amazing because you only need yarn you could do it with string that's made for bracelets I tried it it was it's kind of bulky 
like the bottom kept poking out and I just didn't really like it threw it away of course because you know it sucked which I kinda wish I had it so I can show you what it would look like in the string version instead of the yarn version if that makes sense and you know I like doing this at school or on the bus because it's very relaxing unless of course you guys rather do you know talk to your friends, play on your phone or you know read I like bracelet making because it's very relaxing and easy for me and you know wow look at that baby go it's it's growing so amazing all you yeah yep 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 okay this would be right about the time where you'd start checking to see if it fits and it fits I mean I can go on a little bit longer you know which I actually think I might so I'm gonna keep going if you remember the pattern now here's oh wait never mind okay never mind You just keep going. Forever. And ever. Installing. For awkwardness. You know. Just the added effects. It's okay. Yep, yep, yep. I have lots of bracelets because I am a bracelet nerd. Okay, so, you know, it fits me. Blah, blah, blah. This is where you rip it out. And I can give you a closer up. Focus. Focus, focus. Thank you. And, you know, this is what it looks like. It's not bad on the back side. Usually whenever you make bracelets like these, usually they look horrible on the back. I do. Oh no, it's stuck. So yeah. Then we're just gonna... To be honest, you don't really need to knot it because that's what you've been doing all along this bracelet. So, you know, just estimate, cut, then attach it onto your hand. Arm. Sorry, not hand. Why would I say hand? It's uh, very hard because you're you only have two hands. Yep. I'm gonna get my friend to do this on me. I can't, you know. And look! You barely have any string left. To me, that's good because I'm not a fan of wasting. Especially when it's art materials. And that is your final resort. A beautiful zipper bracelet. Well, that concludes to our video. Thank you for watching. Please subscribe and have a nice day.